part two in a series of videos uh, geared to help uh, you get out of your rut, take your playing to the next level. Um, today I'm going to talk about two things. Um, we're going to talk about uh, becoming a better guitarist by using a metronome and an acoustic guitar. Um, I feel it's important to use a metronome not necessarily to get better timing or improve your sense of rhythm or time, which will be a pretty good byproduct of using a metronome. Um, but to me, it's important to use one to gauge my progress. If I know that I'm learning a certain musical passage, melody, scale, arpeggio, you name it, chord progression, um, and that I'm having trouble getting from the beginning of it to the end of it, I will practice to a metronome. Uh, the metronome helps me in my mind see how the rhythm lays out across the measures and how the rhythm figures uh, against the pulse. And when I can do that um, and get the passage down at a slow tempo or a scale down at a slow tempo, then it's only a matter of increasing that tempo click by click, notch by notch on your metronome until uh, you got it at a pretty good pace. Um, not that playing fast is any kind of means to an end, but those that can play a passage faster certainly have a better time playing uh, these passages cleaner at a slower tempo. Um, we don't have the ability to lift weights and get ourselves, you know, stronger in our hands and our fingers to help us with our coordination necessarily, but we do have the ability to push ourselves to accomplish something quicker and faster. Um, the next closest thing to weights is I find that practicing my warm-ups, my scales, my arpeggios, all the things that I do to keep my chops up, I tend to practice on an acoustic guitar. Uh, not only is it portable and I can sit on the couch and watch TV and do it, um, but generally the tension of the strings and the action is a bit higher than I'm used to on my electric guitar. And I find that if I can accomplish uh, what I want to on the acoustic and put in the time, um, I'm a lot stronger of a player. And when I do pick up the electric guitar, I feel that I'm even that much faster. It is as if I went to the gym did some reps with some heavy weights, went back to my usual set of, I don't know, 25 pounders or whatever, and those felt now even lighter than they did before. Um, so generally speaking, use a metronome. When you practice, you wanna find a tempo that's comfortable, that you can play the pattern, the scale, the arpeggio, the chord progression uh, cleanly and uh, in time. If you're having problems executing, slow it down a little bit more. When you find the right tempo, that's where you want to start with and then slowly inch your way up uh, bit by bit. Um, I hope this helps. Keep your eye out for another video in this series. Coming soon. Thank you.